हेलो स्टूडेंट्स लेट्स स्टार्ट विथ क्वेश्चन नंबर थर्टीन आई थिंक अप टू क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेल्व वन टू ट्वेल्व वी हैव अंडरस्टूड नाउ इन क्वेश्चन नंबर थर्टीन इट इज गिवेन इन द फिगर दिस इज द फिगर क्लियर ए बी सी डी इज ए ट्रेपिजियम क्लियर एंड एंगल ए डी सी इट इज नाइंटी डिग्री ए बी इज गिवेन टू यू फिफ्टीन सेंटीमीटर सी डी इज गिवेन टू यू फोर्टी सेंटीमीटर एंड वन डायगोनल ए सी इज द डायगोनल इट इज गिवेन टू यू फोर्टी वन सेंटीमीटर यू हैव टू कैलकुलेट द एरिया ऑफ ट्रेपिजियम नाउ ऑल ऑफ यू नो टू कैलकुलेट टू कैलकुलेट द एरिया यू नीड टू फाइंड आउट हाइट विदाउट हाइट यू ओन बी एबल टू फाइंड आउट द एरिया ऑफ द ट्रेपिजियम सो now here in this figure you observe the figure which one is the height this ad is the height altitude clear this perpendicular this perpendicular line is the height ad is the height but ad value is not given to you what is given only only adc is equal to 90 degree so you have to find out ad is the AD value you have to find out clear or not? Have you understood that AD is the altitude because perpendicular distance is the height? You know or not? So how to find out AD from this trapezium? Clear? Now see here. This way this is the figure clear. Now what I have done? You see here in triangle ACD. This is the right angle triangle ACD. It is right angle triangle. Yes or no? Because it is ninety degree. Now here in right angle triangle, what you have to find out from the Pythagoras theorem. Again from the Pythagoras theorem, you have to find out AD perpendicular. AC is the hypotenuse. DC is the base. Clear? So with the Pythagoras formula, AC square is equal to AD square plus CD square. It is the main formula. From there, you have to find out AD. So AD will be what value is given to you? AC value is given to you. CD value is given to you. Place the values. AD has come what nine centimeter clear. So you have got AD as nine centimeter. That means height you have got. Now you have to find out the area. Clear. So you will find out the area half into. B one plus B two into H, clear? Half into B one plus B two into H. So B one is fifteen centimeter, B two is forty centimeter. Height you have got nine centimeter. Place the value, find out the area of the trapezium. Understood? How to find out, everyone? You have to think. Clear students. I don't solve all the sums. I will make you understand. You have to think and you have to solve by yourself with the formulas. So formula you have to remember. Clear. Practice the formulas every day. Now onwards, most of the chapters will be based on formulas. so you have to practice the formulas every day if formulas will be clear to you you will be able to solve any sums any sum understood or not so this is the question number 30 and question number 14 what is given now it is totally change this is the question figure here given find the area of the pentagonal field it is A pentagonal field. Pentagon means what? Five sides. One, two, three, four, five. Clear? Pentagonal field shown alongside all dimensions are in meter. Here, whatever the measurements are given here, all are in meter. You have to find out the area of the pentagon. Now. Up to trapezium, the formulas you have got for pentagon, hexagon, heptagon. There is no particular fixed formula. Clear? Now this type of figure, this is the irregular polygon. Pentagon is a 
is an irregular polygon so where you will not get any particular formula what you have to do this type of irregular polygon or whatever others regular polygon you have to first make the parts of the figure either in rectangle form or maybe in the square maybe in the triangle maybe in the parallelogram maybe in the trapezium you will first make the parts of the figure according to your comfortable way clear now see this figure it is drawn already here this figure has been made into five parts first this one one triangle it is a trapezium again this three are the triangle clear now here the values are given see here so now what you have to do as here four triangles are there and one trapezium as is there so you have to find out the area of these four triangles separately and you have to find out the area of this trapezium separately then all the areas you will add means you, you will find out the total of all the areas then that will be the actual area of this pentagonal field clear now see the figure everyone has the book you will from the book you will see the figure here also you will see here this value is given to you you can see from your book also df is given 20 meter fc is given 30 eh 30 this h a is 50 gb is 50 fg is 40 fc is 30 now see if you will find out the first area first triangle triangle formula is what half into base into altitude so because it is a general triangle scaling triangle half into base into altitude so this is the base from this triangle cdf df is the base and altitude is means what height it is the height cf is the height so with this formula you find out the area of first triangle then come for the trapezium for the trapezium this df and eh are the parallel sides clear and this fh is the height fh perpendicular clear perpendicular distance now what is the value of this total fh fg is 40 and gh is 30 so 40 plus 30 will be what 70 that means value of fh is what 70 that means height is 70 so height 70 two parallel sides are these two you will find out the area of this trapezium then third one triangle again base into height eh is the base h a is the height again with formula half into b into h you will find out next come for the fourth this one it is also a triangle so here also base into height here base is bg 50 and height is ag ag means what h plus hg so h is 50 hg is 30 50 plus 30 is 80 that means its height is what 80 same way here also this is the base gb is the base and height is gc gc means what gf plus fc so 40 plus 30 70 so here now in this way after finding this one in this way you will write first one by one i have written the formula one by one you will place the value you will find out the area of each separately clear after finding the area of each polygon separately you will take the sum of all the polygons clear understood students then it will be the total area of this pentagonal field got it how to find out the area of irregular polygon or it may be regular polygon if it will be more than four sides like you know up to the formula means area of uh, quadrilateral solve clear but pentagon heptagon hexagon uh, octagon 
clear these all it doesn't have any particular formula to find out the area so those figures you have to make the parts in different quadrilateral or triangle clear then you find out the area of each fig uh, polygon separately then you take the sum of it clear so this 13 and 14 sums you have to solve in this way clear step by step so your first exercise is complete exercise 16a all the sums you will first you will observe the videos very carefully clear then you solve by yourself don't just copy the videos and don't write from there clear or not that's why i will attach the documents later on first you will observe the videos carefully then you close your mobile solve the sums by yourself got it students so question number six uh, exercise 16a is complete next i will move for the area of rhombus but beforehand i want to means no i cannot see you that's why i have full faith on you that you will solve first this exercise very carefully practice all the formulas next only when i will be getting get sure that you have completed everything i will move for the next clear or not i think you will means you will move whatever may according to me got it Thank you.